I'm sure. I'm sure it's real cool. What? This guy will not like. He won't back the fuck off. Here, you want a railgun? I can give you a railgun if you want. I can give you the railgun. Like that's that's fine. I'll sit behind this rock all day too. That's cool with you. Oh hey, right. Yeah, I think I got it. Yeah, there is a vulnerability detected. Damn right. It's his fucking face. That dumb bitch. Oh, here we go. I got this. Space. Space it up. Space jam right here. Right there. Right then and there. Space jam. You better be fucking dead. I better not be dead. I hit space like the game told me to. Don't even screw me out of this victory, you piece of shit. I earned it. I earned this victory. Oh, God. Oh, he's done. See you later. That guy's fucking dead. Oh, yeah. Let me, let me kill it with a bow. I'm going to kill it with a bow. Whoop. Brag out. Right in the vulnerability. Bravo. Bravo, crisis guy. And now the aliens just explode. See ya. Get out of here. Even though I have no idea how the hell we're going to rebuild here with a giant electric cyclone going on. But you know what? We'll contain it. We'll find out how to use it as an energy source. Michael, get out of there! And then it'll attack us. This fucking harness is stuck! No time. We're too late. They're through. I'm gonna get you out of there. Crawford! Yeah. Budge! Hold on! Michael! <sighs> the suit! I can't! Damn it, Budge! It was never just about the suit! Oh, see ya! Bunch! I just got sucked into the electric cyclone. What How am I gonna get out of that? Prepared to sacrifice? When they came to me with the nano suit, I sacrificed Lawrence Barnes, the man I was. To become Prophet. 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 Maybe the greatest tactical combat machine the world has ever known. Just following orders. Is it even human? You might as well be a fucking machine. But when you've sacrificed everything you had to become a perfect, cold, hard, logical machine, and that machine fails. What happens then? But hold on. Everybody has a choice. When profit fails, what's left? Lawrence, you have something, profit. But. Hold on! Something the Seth will never have or understand. Lawrence! It was never just about the suit! But! Hold on!
So someone flies by and, you know, gets him out of the suit or gets him out of space and just brings him back in. And then you got Crisis 4, possibly. I have no idea what they've said about this series, whether they're going to end it at this or continue it on. And I guess we're just entering the game. Is there another level? I don't think so. I thought this was the last level. No! The nanites in your suit are free. They can transform into anything, any form imaginable. Archangel. Total orbital annihilation. Can we transform into a spaceship? I mean, if we could transform into a spaceship, we could just kind of go back to Earth and then transform back into ourself. Except I don't think that's how it works like that. I think it's a little bit different. Oh, hey! We have to blast the shit out of this thing. Nice! Well, fuck whatever this is. All right, here we go. I got this right here, right here. Let me let me line it up right there. Boom! Come on, come on, come on. Mouse one, mouse one. I got this. Hurry up and lock you piece of shit. There you go. We're ready to fire. Or do you just do a kamehameha right here? Seventy-five percent charge. Kamehameha. See ya. That thing's fucking done. Oh, am I going to have to shoot this thing again? Oh, well, I guess not. There you go. Question answered. Well, I bet that thing has some regrets now. Since it just got extra blown up. I may have some regrets here in a second. Oh, God. I'm going to get, like... Pushed right back into Earth. Ow. Is his suit designed to take... Oh my god. I apparently it is designed to take that. Except he's kind of on fire right now, so... It's gonna be like Commander Shepard. They're gonna have to rebuild him. Cerberus is gonna have to come and save the day. Oh, that was a quick rebuild. Good job, Cerberus. Good job. Bravo. A lot faster than what happened with Shepard. First week of boot camp, they taught us a lesson. A good soldier knows there's only one thing he can rely on when the chips are down. Not his cutting edge intel, not his state of the art equipment, not his top of the line weapon, just himself. Took me a long time to remember that. For now, the war is over. I made mistakes along the way, but after all, I'm only human. Yeah, because you had to ditch the suit. My name is Lawrence Barnes. Except he doesn't need they the suit. Told me, Prophet. Well, I guess Prophet lives in a shanty hut down by the river now, so that's great. Remember me. 
I guess he just landed there and is like, you know what? This is this is a pretty good place to build a shanty hut. I'm gonna I'm gonna build it right here. You know, Chris Farley had a van down by a river. I have a shanty hut down by a river. It's a step up from a van. But that is the end of Crisis Three. I don't know roughly how long that took. It was probably like a half hour to an hour or something like that. But uh, overall, it was you know what I expected. I expected just you know general FPS game is better than than the average you know general sort of FPS game I would say so um, I don't know much about the multiplayer though so you would have to uh, look elsewhere for information on that but campaign was alright about six hours something like that somewhere around that neighborhood um, not much not much super special super special not much super special I mean, if you played the other crisis games then you'd know roughly what to expect especially if you played two you would know roughly what to expect um it's not too far off from two i would say though they tweaked and balanced some stuff at least for the single player because i know in crisis 2 you could just kind of invisi past everything i don't know if it's the same for this game I, I haven't really seen people complaining about it but when i played crisis 2 a lot of people were saying like oh thank god someone's actually shooting stuff every every playthrough i've seen is just someone you know Stealthing past everything, which I don't know. Play the game the way you want to play it. If they want to stealth past it all, then they can stealth past it all. I'd, I'd rather just shoot shit, in my opinion. That's my uh, play style. I'll just jump in and start shooting stuff, but I don't even know if I can. Uh, apparently, I can't skip this. So, there you go. There's, uh, there's Crisis 3. Apparently, I have some unlocks, game videos, and a music score, so that's fantastic. But I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, would I recommend buying it? I don't know. If you have extra money, you want to play an FPS game, or if you're going to play the multiplayer, sure. But if you're looking for an epic campaign, I don't know. It's usually hard for me to talk about FPSs. A lot of them feel very, very similar to me. Like, that's just how it goes. But, uh, no, there you go. Another game done. Now I just need to get a bunch of other shit done. But as long as I can get a game a week done, roughly, then I'm happy with that because pretty much a game a week is coming out until, like, the end of March. And then after that, I don't know what really comes out in April. So we'll see. But that's it for me. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys later.